globally recognized Nigeria Energy Conference has over the years recorded tremendous success in Nigeria's oil and gas sector. Many have said the Nigerian Content Act is one of the best things that's happened in the country as it has galvanized and installed a great deal of initiative and endeavor. CNBC Africa's Umu Ibrahim caught up with Dr. Alirio Para, who is the senior associate of the CWC Group at the ongoing Nigerian Oil and Gas Conference and started by asking why it is very important to have the yearly conference in Nigeria. Do take a look. This conference started in London precisely 13 years ago. We moved it to Abuja in 2007. At that time, we held our first exhibition here. We attracted 100 exhibitors, but only 10% of those exhibitors were Nigerian. Today, just a few years later, we have over 200 exhibitors and 100 disappointed exhibitors who could find no room here because the hall is not big enough. And we have not 10%, but 90% Nigerian. I think that this is a very elegant measure of how Nigeria has evolved on the one hand, and on the other, how the Nigerian energy industries have developed and grown. I think it is, it reflects the great strides that this country has taken forward in these intervening years. Nigeria has recorded tremendous progress since the inception of the oil and gas you know, conference 13 years ago. Now, how important do you think this conference is to the Nigerian energy industry? Well, we are really interpreters of what is developing in Nigeria. We don't lead, we follow, and we're very neutral uh, uh, interpreters. But I feel that these meetings engender dialogue, they engender discussion, they allow for the free exchange of views, and out of these presentations, discussions, debates, new ideas arise and you see them coming together bit by bit as you go through the conference. It is really wonderful to be here every year and to be able to walk right through this conference from the beginning to the end. Now, over the years, we've seen the Nigerian energy industry grow. We've seen a lot of um, investors troop into the industry. Where do you see Nigeria's oil and gas you know, sector in the next five years to come? I think it's important to say, in the beginning, there have been great strides forward. You know, and Nigerians often don't recognize the credit they should give to their oil sector, being great strides forward in oil, in gas. Nigeria is becoming a gas country rather than an oil country. Gas will power the future development of the country. So there have been, and of course, one of the most important developments that I could just pluck out, of, out like that and say without any reservation, has been the Nigerian Content Act. It's galvanized the country, it's installed a great deal of initiative and endeavor, and it's made Nigerians realize that they are capable of great developments in engineering, in construction, in manufacture, in putting together small, medium, and large projects. And that should be a great credit for the country. The challenges, of course, are many. But, and I'm not going to go on much further, there are many challenges. I'll talk a bit about this tomorrow. But one of the things that I do want to say is, in spite of all these concerns, constraints, in Africa, 
There's nowhere like Nigerian oil and gas. Nobody equals this. It's the biggest, it's the best. There are enormous resources here. There is great talent. There is infrastructure. There's a class of engineers and middle, middle management group that is developing and being created. And I think it really is um, a great place to be. We'll see about the challenges and the constraints tomorrow.